Opening Prayers, Prayer 1 Thanksgiving Blessing, O Lord. We thank you for this earth, our home, for the wide sky and the blessed sun, for the ocean and streams, for the towering hill and the whispering wind, for the trees and green grass. We thank you for our senses by which we hear the songs of birds and see the splendor of fields of golden wheat and taste autumn's fruit, rejoice in the feel of snow and smell the breath of spring flowers. Grant us a heart opened wide to all this beauty and save us from being so blind that we pass unseen when even the common thorn bush is aflame with your glory. For each new dawn is filled with infinite possibilities for new beginnings and new discoveries. Life is constantly changing and renewing itself. In this new day of new beginnings with God, all things are possible. We are restored and renewed in a joyous awakening to the wonder that our lives are and yet can be. Amen. Prayer 2 Prayer of Gratitude Thank you, Lord, for the blessings you have bestowed on my life. You have provided me with more than I could ever have imagined. You have surrounded me with people who always look out for me. You have given me family and friends who bless me every day with kind words and actions. They lift me up in ways that keep my eyes focused on you and make my spirit soar. Also, thank you, Lord, for keeping me safe. You protect me from those things that seem to haunt others. You help me make better choices and provide me with advices to help me with life's difficult decisions. You speak to me in so many ways so that I always know you are here. And Lord, I am so grateful for keeping those around me safe and loved. I hope that you provide me with the ability and sense to show them every day how much they matter. I hope that you give me the ability to give to them the same kindness they have provided to me. I am extremely grateful for all of your blessings in my life, Lord. I pray that you remind me of just how blessed I am and that you never allow me to forget to show my gratitude in prayer and return acts of kindness. Lord's Prayer Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Day 12 Day 12 Scriptures for Meditation John chapter 19 verse 28 After this, Jesus, knowing that all things had already been accomplished to fulfill the scripture, said, I am thirsty. Scripture reference Genesis chapter 28 verse 15 Behold, I am with you and will keep you wherever you go and will bring you back to this land, for I will not leave you until I have done what I have promised you. For the gift of the Savior and Redeemer, Jesus my Redeemer, my God, my most gracious good, I beg you to give me the grace to accept the gift you have freely offered me. I am trapped by my own sins and selfishness under the weight of my own wants and fears. I know you're calling me to a life of renewal, grace and holiness. I know you have a plan for my life that I need to accept and claim. Heavenly Father, I beg you to help me. Give me the grace that I need to do your most holy will. Surround me with angels and saints to help me battle the demons who wish to assault me with a barrage of lies. By the power of Jesus Christ, your beloved Son, and my most wonderful Redeemer, I have come to know your infinite love and endless mercy. I beg you have mercy on me, a sinner, and by the power of his holy cross, and through joining him in a most holy suffering, that you might allow me, for the sake of my own redemption, to grow a true and deep and lasting love for you that will give me eternal life. I ask you to help me say, with a true and everlasting love, Jesus my Redeemer, you are the just judge, holy and true. You gave us life by your love and suffering. Teach me to suffer for the sake of your love, Jesus my Redeemer. You hold all power in your hands. You are the mighty one from God who carried the world and is ruler over all the earth. Teach me to suffer for the sake of your love, Jesus my Redeemer. You are the giver of life. In you is mercy and love. In you is forgiveness of our sins. Teach me to suffer for the sake of your love. Jesus my Redeemer, in you is freedom of worry and freedom of pain. Only you can offer your peace, a peace that passes all understanding. Teach me to suffer for the sake of your love. 
Jesus, my Redeemer, you love me so much. You were sent from the Father. You came to save me from destruction, the lost sheep from another fold. Teach me to suffer for the sake of your love. Jesus, my Redeemer, you are the great physician. You alone can heal me. Save me from the demons that seek to destroy me and heal me of my sin that separates me from you. Teach me to suffer for the sake of your love. Jesus, my Redeemer, your gift of healing is alive through the Holy Spirit. I trust you will heal me. Only you can protect me from the enemy and from the loss of my soul. Teach me to suffer for the sake of your love. Jesus, my Redeemer, you are a miracle worker for the sick and for the lost souls. You forgive my transgressions and save me from condemnation. You cleanse me and offer to renew my life. Help me to love you with an everlasting love. Jesus, my Redeemer, you give me a clean heart full of peace. You are the light of the world. In you is all truth. Your way, Lord, is the way to heavenly hope, and your words to me are truth. Help me to love you with an everlasting love. Jesus, my Redeemer, you spoke and the world came into being. You are the giver of life. You have promised me an abundant life in you, and I desire to walk with you. Help me to love you with an everlasting love. Jesus, my Redeemer, you are the vine. Protect me from the evil one, so that I may be grafted to you. I want to be a branch, ever dependent on you and your church as my source of love and light. Help me to love you with an everlasting love. Jesus, my Redeemer, you carry all knowledge and all power. You, Lord, are my medicine. Your words, Lord, are truth and life. Help me put my trust in you. You, Lord, are my greatest good. You know my thoughts, my fears, and you feel my pain. Teach me to suffer for the sake of your love, so that I may grow to love you with an everlasting love and serve you faithfully all the remaining days of my life and merit to see you face to face on that glorious day when you call me into your presence and say, Well done, my good and faithful servant. Lord, in my suffering, I choose to unite myself to you. I will carry my cross with an everlasting love for you, for having given it to me in your mercy and wisdom, for the sake of my own redemption and for the salvation of those most dear in my heart. You are my most loving, most merciful Savior. To you be all glory, honor, and praise. Amen.